What's up everybody? This is going to be the fourth time that we are diving once again back into the world of Nightwish. We have done three tracks for them. The first one was Ghost Love Score. The second was Romance Side. And the third one was Devil and the Deep Blue. Or no, sorry, Devil and the Deep Ocean. Okay. Yeah, so this is going to be our fourth track from Nightwish. They said this was the heaviest one. Everyone's like... Because we kept on commenting, like, wanted, like we enjoy the heavier parts of Nightwish. Okay, so people are like, this is the heavier? heaviest one they have. I'm, I'm here so for we it. trust you guys. This is live. Yeah. So we will see if this is the heaviest track we have heard out of the three previous tracks we have done from Nightwish. So. Thank you so much. And welcome to this unique Nightwish show here in a sold out Wembley Arena. Wow. There's a lot of people. Just so you know, we will film this entire show with you here to immortalize this special moment. Oh. So let this become a night we shall never forget. Okay? Okay. Crunch. A lot of guitar crunch. You know, the first thing I, I think of this was Painkiller by Judas Priest. Gave me that kind of vibe. I know you don't like that, or not I that you don't, don't like it, you haven't heard the song, yeah. but that just the intro into it, everything yeah. from start to so far, <laughs> outstanding. Great performance. For the copyrights, I don't know if there is any, sorry to pause it, you know, you don't want to pause it, you know, during a song where a live point is general, well, we but know. we don't know if there's copyrights to this band, someone knows, let us know so we don't have to pause it, but, I mean, I meant to pause it for it to say something, and now I can't remember my thoughts because I was talking about copyrights, so I am so uh, sorry. I will say, I really like her outfit. Uh, yeah, I like I have it. To say, yeah. I like it. Yeah, she's storming around that stage. <laughs> ah! Oh! Oh, now I remember. Sorry. <laughs> you guys are going to really? have to strangle me and kill yes. me. And I guess I will after, deserve it. I will I take do. it. The comments. You want to beat me up a little bit? I understand. The vocals between the two of them is the best I have heard. Through. Yeah. This is the fourth song we have listened to, Night, mm -hmm. Nightwish. And this is the best their combined vocals have sounded to me. Also, that crowd sucks. They're standing there, like not even moving. <laughs> F that crowd. I am sorry. Get moving. What are you doing? Hypnotize 
With each listen, as we listen, like the last song, I was able to like enjoy it, you know, more. I'm like, okay, yeah, I, I right. like, I'm starting to get it. Ghost Love Score was our jump into it, and we're like, we don't know what to make of this band. They're coming yeah, in. Second one, we're like, okay. And then third, the second, the third one, I was like, oh, I'm yeah, in. we're like, okay, <laughs> yeah. I think we get it, yeah, right? Absolutely. And this one just like cemented that. Yeah, it was I liked it. an outstanding performance. Mm -hmm. I mean, the the stage presence, the, the the they're just locked in. They're brilliant musicians. You can hear clear as day how good the band is in the performance and the stage presence. And she she was like badass. Like yeah. like she was really good in this performance, man. I was yeah. like, damn, she owned this performance. She put up one hand during the song. And <laughs> I don't know what the lyrics was, but the second time it came around to the second verse, she put up two like <laughs> gave it for us. One, now I'm yes. giving you two. But she made her point. <laughs> yeah, she made so her point. We're like, okay. Her head was on a swivel, like going like this, doing the helicopter head banging. I think it, to what you said with like the crowd not being into it, I think it was like, there was like a pickup in the song where it's like, okay. Finally, wake man, up, I just guys. Like, let's go. In. Like, and it's like, um, hear my voice. She like took them under her like spell. Like it really seemed like we were, <laughs> were being like spellbound. Well, Nightwish is a great, that's a great way to put it because Nightwish really does give you this kind of operatic, dramatic, like theatrical Very, feels. Very, you get music, sucked you get in. sucked in. And you're yeah. like in this kind of world and almost like a movie sense of the uh -huh. time and just a, a period of time. I'll, I'll, I'll reel it back in because I'm going to get a little too crazy, but you know, and then the, the, it was sold out. And the, the amount of people there, I think when it first started, people must have been shocked. They must have been staring at the band like, happy so. to see Nightwish. I don't know if this is their opening track or their, their whatever. But this is like the second half of the track, they finally woke up, like you said. And I'm like, yeah, I was like, but, what? But, I think, but I think it does happen also where it, it, it doesn't necessarily mean that the crowd's not into it. It means, like right. you said, Absolutely. they're in awe of right. what they're watching. And that's, that's why, you know, we've gone to see bands where we've heard their there. music and you see them like, live oh and you're, you're, your jaw is just, I'm just dropped. Like, I'm just going to stand here and, yeah. You're in awe. You're like, like, oh my God, they are doing this live. Yeah, we'll jump off that. And, uh, Nightwish, um, Nightwish fans, Nightwish fans of the band. Lead us in the right direction. After this is, like we said, our fourth time listening to Nightwish. And uh, I'm sure Into the Chronic, you will join in at some time <laughs> and help us as well. Right. So let us know in the comments below. Yours is 